All right, stop. Collaborate and listen. Vanilla Ice is back with his brand new, uh, let's say, intention, which is to get a brand new home. Hi, Laura Clark from the Walking Humane Society. Good morning. How are you? I'm great. I'm glad. We have uh, Mandy is shooting the video today. Thank you, Mandy. Because Jimmy's normally our photo and he's right. still on vacation. Right. Mandy's just going to do anything not to have to touch the cafe critter. Is I that think. what it is? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, but the cafe critter, um, first of all, I blame you too because you've now got the entire staff at the Wacom Humane Society naming animals after old rock stars. I would just like to point out that's a trend that started before I'm we got involved. We just. You too. Okay. All right. um, but check this out. So, if you're looking for a Halloween costume, what does this remind you of? Donald Trump. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Look, it's the comb over. Yep. yep. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. It's kind of awesome. Now, will he want to uh, sit on your head for Probably the entire not. Halloween party? Probably not. Although this little guy is super social and he's really a nice little guinea pig. <laughs> he's got a funny face. And you can do fun things with his hair. So, sure? you know, it's a win, win, win. But he is one of many, many small animals we have available right now for adoption. Everything from hamsters to guinea pigs to snakes to iguanas to rabbits to rats. I mean, you want it, we've got it. And we've got a lot of barnyard animals too right now. We've got chickens and geese and, and goats. And so the inn is full and we need the cafe listeners to step it up and come on down and give some of these guys a great home, especially Mr. Ice here. Let's get on it, people. Let's go. Okay. Uh, are you looking for somebody who is an experienced guinea pig owner or is a first timer? Uh, okay. You know, this guy is so social and so easy. If you were first timer and you wanted to just do a little research on what guinea pigs need and our staff can help you with that, I think this guy would make a great companion. He loves to be held, which is really nice. Yeah. So a respectful kid or kids in the family would be a good bet. The thing about guinea pigs is they are, um, they're, they're considered prey animals. And so they like to hide when they feel I would threatened too, yeah, that big. when you're this little. So he needs some, a uh, nice cage kept clean where where he can stay um, healthy and then some type of nesting box. And you can actually buy kind of a, a groovy nesting box, or you can take a shoe box, cut a hole in the middle someplace where he can go in and feel safe, put some shredded paper in there for him. And just someplace, his own little man cave where he can feel secure is what he's going to need. And then when he feels happy, he's going to make that nice little weeping noise. Let's go. Can you make that noise right into for the us? mic there, buddy. Oh, he's rapping. Yeah. Vanilla Ice mm -hmm. is rapping yeah. for us. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. He's got a good beat. He does, yeah. He's got it down. Yeah, he yeah. does. So if you're looking for a groovy little critter, you got to come meet these guys. <laughs> he almost looks fake. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. He's like frozen. He's got like, such a cool face. I love him. He does. And what I like is if he were my guinea pig, I'd do this fun thing with his hair. I'd give him a little guinea pig mohawk right here. Yeah, that's what I would do. I would you do could that. do that at your house. Yeah. Vanilla ice could be yours if you're the right home. All you have to do is stop by the Humane Society and you can schedule like a private meeting with him, right? You've got a little meeting room there. Absolutely. Okay. We have several meet and greet rooms and you can get to know him. And if you fall in love, which you will, you can take him home. He can be yours. All right. We are stacking up on critters. Yeah. So let's do something about that. Laura Clark from the Whatcom Humane Society. Thank you so much. Have a great week.